Google's cloud gaming platform Stadia is adding three new games this week, allowing players to survive on an island filled with frogs, solve puzzles in World War I, and defeat Lex Luthor alongside your fur friends. So, let's talk about it. Are you listening? Hey, welcome back to the Nerf Report. My name is Bryant, and for today's show, we are jumping right into the news that Google's cloud gaming platform Stadia will be receiving the likes of Time on Frog Island, DC League of Super Pets, The Adventures of Crypto and Ace, along with Valiant Hearts, The Great War, this week. So, as is tradition, when any new game arrives on a cloud gaming platform, we dive straight into them to see what gamers can expect when the games arrive on Stadia. So first up, let's talk about Time on Frog Island, which strands players on an island paradise filled with a village of friendly frogs. Now, according to the developer, players will enjoy a sandbox island life, explore at your own pace, solve sticky situations, and trade your way to fix your ship. And while I haven't had the chance to check this game out as it literally released today, it is definitely worth pointing out that Time on Frog Island is free to claim for all Stadia Pro subscribers. Up next, we have DC League of Super Pets, The Adventures of Crypto and Ace from Outright Games. According to the developer, players will suit up as Super Dogs Crypto and Ace as you soar through the streets of Metropolis. Lex Luthor and his Lex bots are causing chaos and it's up to you to use your skills and ability to foil Lex and his plans. DC League of Super Pets The Adventures of Crypto and Ace will be released for Google Stadia on July 15th. And finally we have Valiant Hearts The Great War which was originally released in 2014 from Ubisoft. The game tells the story of four cross destinies and a broken love in a world torn by probably guessed it, War. Valiant Hearts The Great War at its core is an action puzzle side-scrolling game which features a really unique 2D comic book art style. Now as far as reviews go, this game has received a 7.7 .7 out of 10 from IGN, an 8 out of 10 from Nintendo Life, and at the time of recording this, it currently has a 77% on Metacritic. Valiant Hearts The Great War will be arriving on Google Stadia starting July 15th. Three different games, and well, Yes, none of these are technically AAA games. I would be lying if I didn't say I was intrigued by time on Frog Island. I mean, the game definitely seems like it's targeting a younger audience, but I'm interested. Plus, it's on Stadia Pro, so it's free. So why would I not check this game out? But anyway, enough from me. What do you all think about these three games coming to Stadia? Are you going to check out any of them? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Hey, thanks again for checking out our channel. If you like what you saw and you want to see more content just like it, which who wouldn't, uh, hit the subscribe button right there. And while you're down there, hit the like button. Maybe even consider becoming a Nerf Report best friend, just like the people listed down below did. In fact, don't you want to see your name there? I know I do.